Hey, we got the Buddha working tonight. Coming up on Halloween 2011. I'm Magnar. Yeah, yeah. I'm Sveti. What are you? We're the Holy Brothers, by the way. Yeah. Get used to it. You haven't already. Yeah, it's too late now. Because it's done happened. Poof. Didn't mean to blow your mind. People enjoyed our uh, guest star recently, so we're going to interact, bring back an old friend. Here's, where is the thing? Billy Baloney. Billy Baloney, everybody. Hey, everyone. Glad to be back. Looking at your sappy asses. <laughs> it makes me suspicious. Makes me want to go back in the closet. Oh, yeah. But that didn't sound right. Back in, in the box. Yeah. All right, Billy, behave yourself. All right, what are we here to talk about? You had a theme, my brother. Well, no, not really a theme so much as as, as, a, as a clarification, mm -hmm. if not an apology. Wow, so an to apology speak. Well, from, see, an, a, from an old brother? You see, yeah, see, I don't think in old old Viking language there's a word for of. apology. So I'm just going to make a clarification mm -hmm. on my views about the Mormon Church and its its followers. Seems to be in the news quite a bit. I, uh, I was once a Mormon. Generic Protestant minister fuckface from Texas seems he's qualified to call the Mormon Church a cult. He's, he looks very much ferret like himself. Yeah, a ferret face, toupee wearing talk, douchebag. Talk about the pot calling the kettle black. It's yeah. like, what, what? You got more members, so your, your cult is more relevant? You're 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 all basically in a cult that started with twelve guys, aren't you? And a chick who nobody liked at first, aren't you? You're talking about the apostolites? And yeah. Like yeah, 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 yeah. And, and, and Mary. Cross-eyed Mary. Cross-eyed Mary. Oh, Mary, having a cross-eyed baby. Nah, it's funny. It's, it's, it's an inside joke. Really inside. So shut up. Anywho, so okay, Mormon Church. Focus. All right. Mormon Church, basically super good people. Some of our, our relatives belong to the Mormon Church, and, and my God, you know, I you probably know I probably insulted them in the past. I have to agree with you. When bad things happen, no matter where it is, for whatever reason is behind it, they're the first ones there to help people, and they will continue to help you until you either join the church or you don't need their help anymore. It's true. And they've then, helped me. You know, my eye problem. See, yeah. Optic nerve. He had one lazy eye, now he has two. Anywho, so they're not bad people. They're just like, got a couple of kinks to them, especially when they get into local politics. You know, they just follow on their own weird. And not even local politics, that deal in California a few years ago. Yeah, you know, stop it. They're doing their own weird thing. They all do their weird things. The Southern Baptists, they do their weird things. Sure, every one of them tell you things know, their way. Shit, Lord. Oh, don't, Lord Almighty God, give don't me Don't tell break. me that 90% that of the teabaggers aren't some Protestant religion of some sort, be it Methodist, Lutheran, Baptist, Presbyterian. Don't, you know. I'm a reality, I'm a realist. Yeah, until it's proven really. otherwise to me, you're all cults, okay, mm. to one degree or another. Doesn't mean you're all a bunch of cousin fuckers, okay. As soon as I get, as soon as I get some proof, as soon as I get some proof, I will, uh, you know, as soon as an angel comes and talks to my ass, yeah, lay some gold tablets on me. Gold is bringing a huge amount right now. I, Imagine what several tablets are. Bring. Take it to that pawn shop on TV. Ooh, man. They'll melt it down. No, they awesome. keep it. So anyway, there you go. If I'm offended, especially my Mormon relatives, who, 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 who I don't see near enough, but still dig the shit out of, especially our, our crazy Kyle of the, of the South, Democrat, this guy, pretty cool stuff. Um, with the giant mustache, you crazy guy. We I dig you. I like giant mustaches. I thought about growing one. You get food in them. Yeah, food storage. Mm. There you go. So yeah, other than that, you're all a bunch of weirdos. Yeah, man. Get over yourselves. <laughs> that goes for you, everybody. Jewish people, Muslims, 
I kind of dig the uh, American Indians aspect of things, but that's just my liberalness, I guess. I think they had it right. Well, yeah. A, a, as much as anybody ever did, they seem to have it right. At least what we know of. They respected the earth and all that, you know. The moose, the deer, the river, the mountain. It's not here for your sake, but for its own sake. And I always dug that one. I only, I, that's what I believe. I don't think that animals are here because we need them and we need to exploit them. I think they're here to do their own thing and get killed in the process. Yeah, don't, yeah, because you're still, we're still top of the food chain type of fellers. I'm a carnivore, I have to admit it. I wish I wasn't. I uh, just eat nuts. You know, I, I heard that if everybody gave up meat and dairy, in America for one day a week. I love dairy. One day a week, it would have like a huge dramatic effect on the Dude, environment. I think how easy that would be to do. Nobody's willing to take these grandiose steps that we need to take. Thank you, Billy. You're you're wise beyond well, your years. Well, we're still in a country where they don't want the first lady to promote, you know, healthy kids and healthy eating for kids. The people are resenting that. So, well, it's more socialism. Yeah, socialism, douchebags. Get off my roads if you don't believe in socialism. Get off my cloud. Get, get, get your kids out of the public schools and, and get off Magnar's cloud. Home teach them. Home teach them, but home teach them right. Yeah. I mean, we don't By need, right, we mean left. We, we don't Billy need any more idiots leftist. in this country. So. Tone down the leftistness. Well, Devil went down to Georgia tone, looking for a soul to steal. Tone, tone down the dumbass douchebaggery for ten minutes. What we need in the White House. Cantor went down to. Cantor went down to Georgia and looking for a soul. A tree. <laughs> what we need in the White House is a goddamn agnostic. I believe you. I think we need that in every house in the world right now. Yeah. If you're gonna pull shit back. You gotta start dealing with reality. Enough with the cartoons already. I don't mean to sound like an agnostic, but I totally am. And see, if you're not, I I don't see where you're coming from. I believe in Peewee. It it took a episode of, of South Park for me to say I'm not an atheist because by being an atheist, you're a part of another religion. Yeah, you are. So you I need to shut the fuck up too. I concur. So, Brother Sveti. In conclusion, Hope let's sum this up. Unless you, what what pissed you off this hey, week? We I, I uh, took. We I took eight about. minutes. Well, I think there's a swing. I think uh, I feel a little energy on the left. So I, I'm curious to see what comes of that. The the worldwide bank protest. Interesting. Going on. Very interesting stuff. It's kind of hard to think it's as sinister as you were maybe thinking last week well, and changing a little I'm bit to soften it up here. To the end. It's hard not to be in this effed up, What do you trust? Up. Who do you trust, man? Yeah, it's hard to trust much of anything. I mean, anymore. if it's really spontaneous. I trust you, Magnar. I trust you as well, Sveti. You know, you look at it, like I said last week, it's like hard not to be cynical. It's like, who's behind it? You know, is it be Coca-Cola put it together? No, I don't trust anything anymore that I see. All I know is what I read in the papers. The funny papers. Or on the intranet nowadays. The WWW. Thank you, Al Gore. Al Gore. Saving the world. Okay. One chick at a time. Alright, now we can sum this up. All right. Al Gore, awesome for inventing the internet. He looks good in a moon moon. Uh -huh. Mormon church. Good on you for all the charitable work you do. Kudos. Bad on you for all the all the political stuff you do. And if you're not from Utah and you're not from Nauvoo, don't cap on the Mormons. What about Idaho? Idaho you can because they're fucking hardcore up there, dude. Word. Hardcore. So and the California ones too. Oh, oh crap. Even the uh, Vegas ones. Yeah, Harry's Reed. <laughs> <laughs> 
And uh, Harry Reid, tear it up out there, man. Do do us do us right. Re Red, religion and up. politics in general, bad, 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 bad. It is. It, it clouds the thinking. Yeah. If oh, there we go, the man coming at us again. If you doubt us, drive by Temple Square one Sunday morning and see how they're not clouded by religion. Live long and prosper. Yeah. Thank you, Billy Baloney, for your awesome appearance this week. Until next week, we'll see you. It's folks. been a pleasure, Oofta. Oofta, and remember, Oofta. my safe word is ah! Oofta. Oofta.